Okay you guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to do batch rendering which basically lets you render multiple files all at once if that makes any sense. So let's say you're doing a walkthrough which has multiple parts to it and you have to go somewhere and you want to render each file continuously rather than going to file and clicking render as each time a file finishes rendering. So I'm going to show you how to do that in this tutorial. So first off, you have your clip Oh, I'm very unorganized. So let me just separate this, split this open. Make this short for you guys to see. Let me change the properties. Okay. All right, it should be better. Okay, let's pretend these two clips or videos are separate and they're two separate parts. So here, pretend is your first part of your walkthrough. You see this yellow marker here? Just drag it. There's your first part and press R and name it whatever you want. We'll name it part one in this case. Now do the same for all the other clips or parts slash videos. So here's my second part in the walkthrough. Just press R again and name it whatever you want. We'll name it part two. After you're done with that, just go to tools, scripting, and batch render. It should open up a window. There you go. Then you can select where you want to render it. We'll render it onto the desktop. You can name it whatever you want, you just click example or whatever. Okay. And look for your settings, rendering settings. So in my case, my render setting is in Sony AVC. And there it is, 720HD NTSC. I'll just select that. And here's the most important part, you need to select render regions. Once you've done that, click OK and it should start rendering automatically. So hopefully this helped you guys you know, do batch rings. It's much quicker as opposed to selecting render as each time a file finishes. Especially when you have like, you know, like 30 parts of, of a walkthrough, you know, you just want to get it done all in one render. So yeah, that's it. If you guys have any questions, post your comments below and I'll try to help you guys. That's it. Thanks for watching.